Well, I guess the Lord put it in my heart to write these stories. Bernard Tibbetts believed he was put on this earth to tell stories about the lives and experiences of people in the Cayman Islands. Well, I've been writing these stories for many years. In, in recent times, I've written many more. I have a total of something like 115 thus far. That book contains 35 of the earlier ones. That book is Written Treasure, Volume 1. One of the first stories in it was about a trip that Reverend King and I had from Little Cayman one night back in 1967. We used to uh, travel between the islands many times without the aid of a compass, entirely by following a star at night. So before leaving Little Cayman, we selected a star to follow. While I was doing some other chores in the boat, uh, Reverend King was steering, and when I went back to the front of the boat, I saw land ahead. So I said, is that Cayman Brack already? He said, I don't know, but it must be because we're making good speed. When I examined things carefully, I determined it was Little Cayman and we were almost about to run up on a reef and be wrecked. That part of Little Cayman did not even have a road at the time. He was following the wrong star. So that gave me an idea for writing that story. Illustrated by his granddaughters, his writing not only chronicles stories of Cayman's past, he says they also include what he calls a moral lesson. All of the stories have an inspirational impact, note at the end. As a Christian, I believe that we should help people to see beyond the problems of today. We need to, to be prepared for tomorrow. While Volume 1 is mostly about events, Volume 2 is in the works and it will be about people. People that have played an important role in the lives of our and history of the island should not be forgotten. I mean, there are many people that have played very important roles and uh, it would be pitiful if, if they're not remembered by someone. And while I'm still able to record some of that, I feel like it's a mission that I can fulfill and try to preserve it. Thank you.